Hello? Really? I'm eligible for the fair, great. Or Really, thanks for sharing. Thank God for your emergency assistance. Oh my fucking God. Um, are you a supervisor? No. Um, could I speak with a supervisor? In regards to what? Well, the emergency box over there, I was talking with someone, then they left me on hold for like 10 minutes, then they hung up, then I called back and they put me back on hold with no conversation, and for nearly 20 minutes I've been trying to get a simple fucking answer, and I'm getting kind of pissed. What was your call of emergency? What time... Is the first train to Santa Monica out of the station in the morning, and if I'm coming from Hollywood Vine, what's the first train I need to grab to catch the first train to Santa Monica? Okay, right. If Hollywood Vine, you do have to... Uh, like Port 10? You're going to take that to 7th and Right. To connect with the actual right. Uh, first one, give me one moment. Does a 410 me. connect me to like a 435 or a 440 that puts me in Santa Monica by 530? Yes, let me get the time. Thank you, and I don't know why the jackass on the other line can't answer that fucking question. Sorry. Yeah, so you understand why I'm a little cranky. I've been trying to get an answer for 20 fucking minutes now so I can go on with my life, and shit, I could have looked this up on Google quicker or whacked off in a fucking windstorm and gotten an answer quicker. I'm sorry, I'm cranky right now. No, no, no. I've been waiting on that phone over there on the emergency line for 20 minutes to get an answer to a simple question. What time do I need to catch the train out of Hollywood later this morning? To get... Anyway, it's being handled. This guy's helping. Okay. Yeah, you don't... I can get through. I... Thank you. Uh, I'll get through. It's not about getting through, dude. It's not a money issue. It's a connection time issue, and I've been trying to get train times for almost a half hour now. On the emergency circuit... And they keep putting me on hold on the emergency circuit. That's why I'm talking to this guy going, dude, what the fuck? It's been almost a half hour. I just need two connecting times, 410 to 520, or what's my connection times to pull off what I need to do this morning and in Hollywood and out on the fucking beach before noon. I'm trying to service too many masters. <sighs> Please give me an answer. Or shall I just go postal now? Okay, why? Who are we calling now? Huh? Mr. Ron, can I help you? Uh, I'm just trying to get simple information now for a half hour. Are you a supervisor? Mr. Ron, can I help you? Can you not? Can you not hear me? I can hear you now. Okay, are you a supervisor? No, I'm not a supervisor. Okay, for like to speak to no, I just want a simple answer to a question I've been waiting 30 minutes for an answer to. What time do I need to leave Hollywood and Vine at around 4 this morning or so to catch the first connecting thing out of 7th Street to get to Santa Monica, earliest flight out? Is it 410 to 540? What are my two connection times? It shouldn't take a half hour to look it up on your Okay, hold schedule. on one second. Hold on, but it gets to your answer. It's been 30 minutes, ma'am. I really... And now I'm on hold again. 440. Hi. And a Highland. So at Vine, it'd be like 445. Uh, it's only about uh, Vine two minutes later, so about 442. Okay, and then what's my connection time here to Santa Monica? Uh, Let me get that. And thank you. Dude, this has been like... A half hour. 
Oh, no, no, no. He didn't just put me back on hold again, did he? Oh, my fucking God. Oh, my God. I told him. God, grant me the serenity. Sheeple. Yeah. Oh, it starts out of here at 401 to Santa Monica? Right, yeah, it starts at 401. Oh, so what's the, so I could catch the 410 then at Hollywood Highland, couldn't I? Or Hollywood Vine? Uh, well, yeah, well, the 410, is the, the, that was, that's the first train that leads from Union Station to North Hollywood. No, no, coming from North Hollywood to this station, what's the first one out of Hollywood Vine at this morning? Right, that's going to be the 440. And then oh, that's the first one? Is it not until almost 5 o'clock before you parole people from Hollywood? Right, yeah, the North Hollywood uh, start, starts a little later there. Okay. I'm sorry, 410 at Union Station, but it does start later. Coming from so it's 440 or 442 is my time out then, so almost 5. Right. And so if I come out at 5, so I would get out to Santa Monica about 630 then? Does that sound right? If I catch the... Five or whatever it is when I get down here, because at 4:40 it takes what 30 minutes to get from up there to down here. Uh, 440, yeah, it'd be about 5:10, 5:15. What time will that hit Santa Monica at about 5:45, 6 o'clock? And he hung up again. Oh fuck it, I'll figure it out myself. Uh, um, yes, sir. Can I help you? Any way that a white man could help oh. another white man? For what? Jump me what? to have what? sex? No. What? No, I'm not asking oh, for what, that. What are you asking for? What do you mean? I'm just helping out another one. Oh, bless you, brother. Truly bless you, because I've had a day from now. Do you smoke cigarettes? I can give you a cigarette. I, a single cigarette would be wonderful. I'll do that. Do you like weed? It's kind of wet, I but this is bomb as we have. All right, hang on. Let me get you. You are such a gentleman, sir. I appreciate your help. And thank you for being patient on this. I've been literally fine for a half hour to get answered. this time. A white man, even though I'm only partly a white man, I'm what mud. they call a widow, okay? I will always... German cigarettes or American? Or whatever you've got. Now here's that 100, and then keep this German one for later. I am Alemana, actually. Alamada? What's that? That's Spanish for German. There you go. Oh, really? Spanish, German. That's an interesting mix. Oops, whoops, oops. There's, there's another one I gave you. I gave you three. Because you did give me a nice hundred change. I do appreciate that. And I'm going up to North Hollywood. If you're I will here. always look out for another white man. I look out for everybody regardless of which color. Be. I'm, not, I'm from Michigan. I'm not You're hiding. superior. We are superior. I just, I don't look at it that way. I think everybody deserves an equal shot. Regardless of race, color, creed. I think everybody deserves an equal opportunity. How else can you ever get ahead if everybody's winning now? You know what? Hitler was a fucking no. But no. we are superior. Okay. Herrenmann. We are Herrenmann. Herrenmann. That, that translates to German. Herrenmann, we who rule. Herrenmann. 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 Her her isn't it interesting that Donald Trump, uh, Trump her is got Hitler's playbook on his desk or wherever he goes, his bed no, and, and a tilde hunt. He was Dutch. Who? Trump? Trump. Oh, Trump is also Trump. German and Russian. He's no, a flip -order. His name was originally Trump. Uh, I think it was trumpet because they used to blow everybody. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, you are so disrespectful. He's draining the swamp for everybody right into his own gullet. He's got so many conflicts of interest worldwide. Mine, Dude, mine. I don't know a whorehouse that's had that many conflicts. But I got to get straight North Hollywood if you're done. The dumb. word is Herrenman. Hairy man. Hair. Hair on men. We rule. Mine okay. hair. Yeah, I'm not worried about rule. I just like everybody oh, to get along. You, you do, you do. No, I really want people to just get along. I don't. Of course, we want people to get along. That's how Why we rule. Why aren't they doing it then? Hair, hair, hair on men, hair on men, right? Hairy man, hairy man. Hold it. Is that a movie like? Is that a movie like uh, Donkey Kong or or Pookie Man? I think it's Pookie Man. Eh. May we have your attention? The last rains are going to. 
Okay. Not to North Hollywood, though, I hope. You guys told me I didn't tell 2.28. What time is it? Shit. Oh, come on. Go down. Can somebody stop fucking sleeping in the elevator? I need to get downstairs. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, yo, can clear up the elevator. I'm just trying to get on the elevator. Thank you. It's coming up. I appreciate that, brother. Good looking out. Yeah, I think Jack, be nimble with Jack. I'll take it a piss. Thank you for pissing in the elevator, you jackass. God, I love smelling your hair. Never. This is Metro. Do you have an emergency inside the elevator? Somebody shattered the window in here and pissed all over the floor, so I thought you might want to know, and it wasn't me. No, it's okay. Shattered window? Shattered window on the rear. It's the top. Yeah, and also, yeah, and also piss all over it. Literally. And it smells like shit. Somebody took a nice fucking piss in there. Ugh. I love pissy elevators. Never! <sighs> I don't like smelling other people's urine in a fucking elevator. It's just annoying. Why can't they put fucking bathrooms in this place? Ridiculous. Oh, wait for an hour for a train, but piss yourself. Just fucking retarded. Los Angeles government. Pennywise, oh, I'm foolish. Sure, why not? Thank you. I don't give a shit. All right. But when the train comes, I gotta put it up to Jim Park. Yes, sir. Well, I, I don't work here. Okay. I don't give a fuck. Why somebody gives a fuck, you should talk about them. I'm not the guy who gives a fuck. Somebody pissed in the elevator and cracked the fucking window. Bottom back windows all shattered. The elevator. What's your name? Kurt Kelly. Kelly. Kurt Kelly. Oh, and this is what? Is this the last train to North Hollywood? Do you know? Yes. I'm just trying to catch the train to North Hollywood before the last one goes out. Okay. This might be it. Yeah. Ah. By the buck. This is the last train in North Hollywood. You want this? I just... I No! 
again? Fuck, I just left this a half hour ago. ridiculous. Is this the last train to Hollywood? Please stand clear. The doors are is this the last train to North Hollywood? I think this is the last train, yeah. And they pulled too far past the crackers. I want to be in fun. Thank you. Mother. This train is going to North Hollywood. This is the red line to North Hollywood. What? In North Hollywood, I think they said. I mean, it passes through Hollywood as well. Yeah, I just wasn't sure that was real English. It sounded mechanically weird to me. Why do we have Russian drivers now? Where was it Chinese? What the fuck was that? The next stop is Wilshire, Vermont Station. Connect here with the Metro Purple Line to Wilshire Western on the same morning level. This is a red line train to North Hollywood. Thank you. Metro Purple Line to Wilshire Western and the Parada. Los trenes del Metro Purple Line arribarán en la misma plataforma de abordaje. Este es un tren del Metro Red Line a Macau. Jack, we can go.
una plataforma de abordaje. Este es un tren de Metro Redland a North Hollywood. Fucking speakers never shut off. Thank you for that. And 
intensely. And make sure your kids have lots of good applesauce. Um, and when you get older, you're going to like it too. Me. Kids, don't do what Uncle Kurt does. It's very dangerous business. When you're trying to save a planet from assholey and leaders. You see, for centuries, we didn't, with gladiators, Vikings, Genghis Khan, Hitler, World War I, II, III, Vietnam, pick a war. We didn't get it right. You see, wars only get people hit on people. Right. Santa Monica Station. Exit here. He killed my hubby, city my spouse, my child, my friend, my brother, my cousin. You're the bad guys. <laughs> it happens on both sides. And it feeds the hate more. And no one wins in the hate game except the haters. And so if your God is better than somebody else's God and you think you can play God with those people, you got another thing coming. You didn't create this shit. And you won't get to make the final decisions. That you can make. I know that to be a fact, Jack. Self? I've been around since the beginning of time. And beyond. I've been in the book of Akashi Records and in many names for centuries. You can believe it. Ask me if I give a flying vote. The answer is quite clear, I know. So, with that said, I want to tell you about how. Please stand clear. The yeah, doors are closing. Teach the bird wrong, sit wrong, and get in the front of the big mother. Hear yourself right to overpower them, to mental torment, physical anguish, constantly putting them down, make you feel better, having one up. You asshole ants. Pilots, listen to you think you are. A part of that group on that um, highway of paved good intentions. the highway to hell. If you think I'm joking, put down the railroad track. Maybe I'm riding the train. Now arriving on Sunset Station. Exit here. I'm like your modern day Jack Stevens. I'm like a Easter egg. And sound now. We got big rhythms. I'm taking hostages. Not on the team, get out of the way. We ain't putting up with the ghost ship. Back to the ghost ship. I have some very sophisticated high level intel working with me on the mic. You will probably never know who they are. Please stand clear. One is the door is for closing. And they work for me, not for you. And even if they work for you, they work for me. They work for me. And they know that. I know that. Round rules with Uncle Fred are always Christian clothes and seem like black and white. You wouldn't grow them? The next stop is Hollywood. Yeah, get away. Yeah. Because I don't care. I'm tired. I have walked millions of miles on this journey. And I'm proud to say, I have stopped wars in my lifetime. Stone, baby. So anyway, the 
said, hey guys, do you remember in 85 when the war stopped, and you and peacekeeping troops came in, and all that food and medicine stuff came in for your families and friends? And, oh yeah, yeah, that was fabulous. Glad it worked. I was here to help. Now, here's the mess down there again, maybe I have to help again, but I was there back in 79, 80. Had the bejesus scared out of me because I thought I was on an all expense paid wild golden West Broadcasters ABC mm. two week all expense paid trip from Detroit to Miami to Belize to the West French Indies, Central America on a barefoot windjammer cruise, fishing, being in the ocean, scoop diving, skin diving. And when I landed in Belize to machine guns, machetes, tanks, and bayonets and people ripping my shit apart. And I went, whoa, wait, hey, I'm with the Golden West Broadcast and ABC News. And, you know, who do you think you are? And I'm also, and somebody tapped me on the shoulder and said, shut up, and I'll get you out of here alive. I'm with the CIA. He said to the people at the airport, the police, the federales, and others, He's with us. They started packing all my luggage up like a five-star hill in hotel. And rushed it out to this Wrangler Jeep. My accompanying female I think knew about this mission. That's why I so freely volunteered to help with my arrangements and other details. Yeah! If they're with me, I'll try to help. Whatever. You know what I'm talking about. But I have made a promise to certain people in high level government around the world to protect the innocent if possible. I suppose the asshole, although I think she was one. It's so far gone now. Seventy-nine. That was a long time ago, children. Um, wow. Huh. Read deep. Forty years ago. I, I don't even know if she's still alive. Honestly. Those of you who knew me back then, knew me during that period. Mark Grimm. Still alive. Excuse me, Robbie Timmons. Who had ABC and he's right next to his ear. WDIV.